data stack will be better than $99 Freud stack made in Italy or the Harbor Freight Special Admiral that I bought for $49.99 a year and a half, two years ago. If you watched my video about five months ago or so, you'll see that I've been pretty happy with my Harbor Freight Admiral data stack. However, after seeing the big difference when I bought a new 10 inch blade for my table saw and it was Freud, I was wondering how much better the Freud data stack would be. What's up y'all? My name's Andy. This is EPS Garage. And the only reason why I say that in a little intro and tell y'all the name of my channel is because nobody seems to be able to pronounce it right. Hey, I think you're going to be really surprised about what I found in comparing the two sets, an expensive set and higher end set. So make sure you stay tuned, hit that thumbs up if you like the video and leave any comments if you have any experience with either one of these and what your thoughts are. I'd be happy to hear them. All right, so right off the bat, here are the obvious differences. The differences in just looking at them and feeling them. The Freud data set is a lot heavier. It feels the blades are thicker. The carbine is for sure thicker. I put them up next to each other and compared them, and they are thicker. So that's going to give you more sharpenings out of it. On the other hand, the Harbor Freight is a little flimsier. I weighed both of them to see the difference, and there was a few ounce difference between each one. I'm not sure what all that means. Maybe one's less likely to warp on you, I don't know. I mean, I haven't had any issues with the Harbor Freight, but these are the obvious differences that I noticed just comparing them and looking at them. So then you're probably wondering, what does each set come with? The Harbor Freight comes with two eight inch 24 tooth outer blades, comes with one 16th inch chipper blade, it comes with four eighth inch chipper blades, and then it comes with a set of about seven for micro shims for micro adjusting your widths. The set also comes with a nice little storage box and some instructions, a little instruction booklet. All right, the Freud data set, it comes with two 8 inch 12 tooth outer blades, comes with three 8 inch chipper blades, comes with six micro, or sorry, six or eight, I think it's eight, eight micro adjusting shims for the micro adjustments. And then it also comes with three 16 inch spacers. And the Freud set, it comes in a plastic case with some simple cardboard instructions. Nothing too fancy. Storage is important. You wanna think about the storage. You don't want your carbide teeth getting cracked and then possibly coming off your blade at God knows what RPM and embedding into your face. That would not be good. So be careful when you're taking them out and putting them back. You wanna watch out for the carbide teeth. Hey, and they cost money, you don't wanna damage them. Now setting up the blades, there wasn't a big difference, just like setting up any other dado stack. There was a difference though in what goes in your stack to make a three quarter inch cut. That's what I based it off of. I figured I would just do each at a three quarter inch cut. So on the Harbor Freight, you use two outer blades and four eighth inch chipper blades, and that gives you an eighth inch groove or cut, whatever you wanna say. On the Freud blade, however, you have the two outer blades, you have the three eighth inch chippers and two 16th inch spacers. So you've got a little bit more going on in there just to get the three quarter inch cut. Um, I don't know, not a big difference, but that's the difference in setting up the blades. Okay, so now I got them set up and I ran each one through the saw. On each one, this was the Harbor Freight, I did one three quarter inch dado, I did a wide, dado because I wanted to see the surface that it left and then I did one rabbit cut and for the most part as far as cutting them and using them it was just as smooth um, the Harbor Freight blades are about a year and a half two years old but I didn't see much difference in like any bogging down like as if they were dull or anything like that of course I don't use them all the time 
but for the most part, they felt about the same on the table saw. Okay, here's what I was curious about. Quality of the final cut. That's what really matters, right? And what you're looking for. And there was a few things I was specifically looking for. How much tear out was on it? Was there any difference? The grooves. Now my Harbor Freight have always left these grooves on the back, on the top end of the cut. It's always kind of bothered me and I always kind of wondered would that happen with the Freud blade? I'll tell you what, the Freud blade does leave grooves just like the Harbor Freight, so no difference there. And the Freud has way more tear out. Um, I was really surprised by that. I mean, the tear out is way worse. As a matter of fact, there's almost no tear out using the Admiral two year old blades than the brand new Freud made in Italy $100 blades. Um, <laughs> so, it is what it is. I, I don't. I, I was kind of stumped by that, to be honest with you. I'd really be curious if you have any experience with both of them and what your take would be. So make sure you leave that in the comments. All right. What do I think ultimately? You know, honestly, if you're new to woodworking and you're wanting to get a dado stack, I would highly suggest getting the Admiral. Harbor Freight data stack, save you some money. Now, on the other end, the Freud, it wasn't a whole lot more expensive. Um, so $49, it was about $50 more, roughly. I've got mine, I was gonna buy it on Amazon. However, Woodcraft ended up having it for the exact same price, $99.99. So that's what I did. I was already there buying some lumber and I bought it there. So it's up to you. I mean, if if you want to get these resharpened, more than likely the Freud are probably the way to go. If you're wanting to get them resharpened multiple times, they do have that bigger carbide. They are a little bit more heavy duty feeling and they are heavier. I mean, it, it, it's, it's totally up to you. I was surprised by the end results. I really thought that the Freud would be this magical difference, but it's really not. Um, hey, again, I hope this helps somebody. I was kind of curious. I think honestly, um, if that blade, if my Harbor Freight blades had gone dull on me totally, I probably would have just bought another set of them if I had already known this. I don't, I, I don't know, that's just me. I'm not one to take a whole set of data stacks to get them sharpened, I guess. I'd rather just go down the store and buy a new stack. Hey, y'all take care, stay safe. I'll see you next time. And, uh, uh, take three.